Alright guys, good morning. I just got my hair done. I blew out my natural hair and put a crochet wig on and I'm really liking the way it turned out. I wanted to change up the intro today and kind of give you a snippet into our lives, who my children are, and the many platforms that you can follow us on. Let's get into today's video. Alright baby, come on, put that away because we have to go see uh, the new property. Beautiful, very beautiful. Put it away, please. We gotta hurry. And then we have to go to can your doctor's we, appointment. Can I dole it at, at the place? No, because we don't know who's there. So we can't take all our stuff to someone else's house. Come on, let's go. Put it away from me. It'll be right there when you come back. Haley, this room is disgusting per usual. Like, Mom. How, how, are you, how are you just functioning in this? I'm wrong. Uh, Terrell said he has to, he's tired and he has to work tonight. So he said after school, if I can pick, pick you guys up to go bowling and take you guys out. out, out. Okay, well, we gotta go see the new property. So come on, please get dressed, put a mask on now. And we gotta go to the new property. Can you put your Crocs on? Can I bring my little down? Fine. Well, we gotta go get a mask, can brush I your teeth. Your charger? Probably, I don't know, but can I charge, can I think on 31? I don't care about these electronics. We have to go, please. Go brush your teeth and let's get going. So he's been doing this a lot. Show me more. Show me. Oh. Show me more. 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 Show me more. Show me. You get that smile. Show me more. 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 Hello, beautiful people. Good morning. Um, we are headed out to a property. Um, I would say just to look at it, but it looks like my mom has already put in an offer on her own. Isn't that great? Uh, I do know it's an older property. Um, it's nowhere near new or what we were looking at before. Um, I guess our only issue is we can find a home large enough for all of us, like a seven bedroom, four bath, but the lot is small or there's no pool or the backyard is limited. Like if we find the house, it has no yard. And if we find the yard, then it has no house. So I guess the only thing that like really gives us a lot of opportunity and space to grow is to buy the land with smaller property and then add on to the property. So that's what we're going to look at today. All right, so see the lot is huge, all belonging to this one house. And it goes all the way around. So this is all belonging to this property. All the way back to the gate. So there's plenty of room to add on. So this is the backyard, one side of the yard. All right, we're just finishing a property and now we're at Namor's Children's Walking Clinic to get in a COVID test for her surgery this week. This is a pre-op screening. This week, Aaron, ba Aaron Barner. Barner? Yes. Don't touch baby, come over here. So you've done a COVID test before, right? Right. So you know what to expect, right? Right. So you can do this, right? I can do it. 
do this. All right, your brother's hair is crazy. That's okay. That one has a mohawk? I guess today he does have a mohawk. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> okay, well, go ahead and take mm. your mask down. Mm. Do you want to lay down or do you want to sit up? Sit up? Okay. okay. So go ahead and swing your legs this way. Okay, then take your mask down. Okay, and then you're going to look up. You can do it. Come on. Just take a deep breath and then I'll give you a sticker after. You want a sticker? Okay, so look up at the ceiling. Does she still have to go in your nose? Ooh. Don't do it. Well done. You did it. You did good. Do you want Elsa? <laughs> Did you get your discs? No. Oh, okay. Just put them in the car and I'll run. Okay. Do you see any that you like? You want to point to one that she has? This one? What do you say? All right. Thank you so much. We're done. You can go. Oh my goodness, Aaron, there's no lollipops. Come on. Go to the door. So these are like the new machines to check temperature. I thought they were pretty cool. You just put your wrist inside and it tells you the temperature. We all done, my love. Crocs on deck. Crocs on deck. <laughs> Show it to me, girl. Beautiful. All right, so now we're gonna just cross the street, get into the car, and probably try to find these little people some lunch. Thank you. Can we go to the Wendy's? Uh, maybe. I can do Wendy's. Okay. You like your sticker? No, 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 no. Let's not eat. Wait, Mom, we draw this. We draw this. I mean, we watch this on TV. What movie is that? Uh, the show, but... Uh, <laughs> I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Delivery. It's called Special Delivery. Oh, we did watch that one with the birds. Uh-huh. Yeah, that one was pretty cool. Uh-huh. I would like it. You think so? Uh-huh. Well, I wasn't there. All right, so Aaron's pre-op is done. We did just finish seeing a property before we came here. Um, Andre's at his friend's house. Haley and Terrell rode with my parents since I had to bring Aaron to get a COVID pre-op for her hernia umbilical cord surgery on Wednesday of this coming week. Um, the property was nice. It's definitely not what you think of when you think buying a home, at least for me. Like I always thought if I bought, it would be like, all brand new, sparkly, ready to go. But Orlando, Florida is such a buyer's market. Like there are literally hundreds of thousands of people that wanna live here and there's like 10 homes available. So usually if you find a big home, it has no lot. And if you find a big lot, someone with cash money comes in and buys it before you. So we were so lucky to snatch this one up when we found it. Um, it is under our price range. It's a huge lot. The home isn't really, Again, what I said, I envisioned brand new, all of these things, but you can always pay and make it those things. Like we can, you know, have a good time remodeling and building as a family. So that's what we're going to do. The lot is literally huge. It's probably almost two acres and it still has a standard size home on it. Five bedroom, three bath with a pool. So we definitely still have enough space to live there in the meantime while we do some work. Um, so yeah, all good news. Hopefully Aaron's COVID test comes back negative so we can move forward. She's had this umbilical hernia since birth. It was a lot bigger and it got a lot smaller over time, but it never decreased enough to close. And her pediatrician just said with her being six, if it's not closed by now, it's not going to close on its own. And she still has an opening in her abdomen. So we're going to get that fixed. So, 
gonna see if I can swing in T-Mobile to get my screen protector fixed because it is cracked. Never mind. T-Mobile was packed. There was a line coming out the damn door, so I will probably go during the week when all of these people that have nothing to do are at work. I work from home, so I have a little bit more leeway, so I will come back during the week. So I'm in line right now at Wendy's trying to be a good mom because I promised her that I would you know, get her some lunch if she did the COVID test, you know, a little reward, just like the same reason why they give stickers and lollipops, but um, I hate going to fast food and it's not fast. Like when the line's super long and wrapped around the building, I'd rather go home and cook something, but I gotta keep my promise. And she doesn't have a seatbelt on. Erin, can you please sit up and put your seatbelt on? Oh, it is on. Okay, JK. Thank you very much. You too. I just had to like take your wig off and breathe. I just had to do that. But now I'm pissed because now I have to go back in Wendy's because instead of giving me my order, they shorted me a burger and fries. Here I go. Wait a minute, Wendy's. No, it, I just, I said two ginger bacons, a small fry and a medium fry. Okay. That's it. So you just need the ginger bacon and a small fry? Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You too. All right, so instead of driving with starving kids, we decided to just park after they got my order right we're just gonna eat in the car all in so are you nervous about your surgery Erin? yes why i don't know what they're gonna do but, they, but i know it's not gonna hurt because they said it's not gonna be any needles yep they're gonna put you to sleep so you're not gonna feel anything so mommy will be there when you go to sleep and i'll be there when you wake up okay all right all right Shake your baby. Shake your baby. Shake your baby. Go. Go. Shake your baby. Everyone is, you know, doing their own thing. I'm gonna feed this little person some more. Haley's eating a snack. Terrell over there is eating a snack. And Aaron is back doing arts and crafts. Dinner has been started. You guys have not seen Andre in today's vlog because he is actually uh, with a friend. They have basketball game tickets tonight. So I will pick him up in a couple hours. <laughs> With some gravy. Mm -hmm. Ooh, girl. How long did you make this, girl? Five minutes. Five. How long it took you to make this, girl?
said you got some more. I have chili. You have chili. Chili. So how did you do this? Did you do it like me and just pour a bunch of chili canned items inside of the crock pot? And let the crock pot make it hot, you know? You don't have to make everything from scratch. If it was you, knowing you, you probably planted these beans six months ago because you had chili in mind. I made oh. the beans. You made the, you... I cooked the beans. Oh, see, I don't do that. I've never cooked beans, ever. I, 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 I buy chili in a can like this and it say chili. Then I pour it in the crock pot. So that's not how you do it? No. No. Okay, so tell me how you did it. I ground the beef. Mm-hmm. I used some natural ingredients of chili. Natural ingredients of chili. I used... Oh, y'all, she didn't open up the cat. Oh, Kathy's junkie. Oh, she had to throw in there that it's junkie because she is a perfectionist. And well, I use actual chili. Oh. Maybe it went back in the ground because you grew it. No. No? Not true. All right, so what's in this pot? Um, beans. And what's in this container? Rice. Rice. Ooh, good. Talk dirty to me on a Sunday. I hear little people. I hear little people playing. Oh. That was my I think he's tired of playing with you. No. We were playing. I don't think so. Nope, I don't think so. Hello, sir. What are you doing standing up with those chunky legs? Look, 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 look at the chunk. I just, I just want to eat it. Oh, I just, I just want to eat it. Throw you in the pot. It's Nana's food. What? I want to. Oh, so you're trying to bite me. Oh, you're trying to bite. Ow, ow, ow. You little monster. <laughs> all right guys i just got this little person to sleep i'm gonna make sure my other three kids are bathed andre should be home soon and i'm gonna end the video here we'll see you in the next one love you bye jeremy Grant.